Hey there YouTube, welcome back to another ham radio video. Today we will be looking at the receive capabilities of five different HT antennas. To do this, I will be using my Yesu FT4X. For the incoming signal, I will be using the factory programmed NOAA weather stations. I will first try channel 1 as the radio defaults to that when first powered on with the weather frequency selected. I will then switch over to channel 6 which is the local NOAA station for my area. We will then look at the S meter to see how well the radio receives with each antenna. Let's get started. Okay, so we just tested all five antennas. For the results, there are seven entries due to two of the antennas being tested in two different configurations. I am ranking them based off the S meter on the radio. A solid square gets one full point while a flashing square gets half a point. Anything over S9 gets a score of S9 plus whatever it's over. Starting at the bottom, the Diamond SRH805S came in dead last. Next, there was a tie between the Nagoya and its collapse date, as well as the signal stuff signal stick while tied into a knot. They both had the same S meter reading on the weak signal as well as the strong signal. Next in line came the Nagoya fully extended. That antenna was beat out by the stock antenna, which performs surprisingly well. The Diamond SRJ77CA came in second place, outdone by the slightly better performing signal stuff signal stick. To be honest, I was actually pretty surprised by the results, especially at how good the stock antenna turned out to be. It is also interesting to note how much performance you lose when you tie the signal stuff signal stick into a knot. I chose to test the signal stick in that configuration due to how often people mention you can tie the antenna into a knot while talking about its flexibility. The overall reason for this comparison was for me to determine what would be the best antenna I currently have with the smallest overall length. As most of us know, antennas are typically a compromise in some way. I will be doing a follow-up video testing the transmit abilities of these antennas. If you found this interesting, please like the video, consider subscribing, and as always, thanks for watching. <laughs> 